Hey guys, welcome to Coronavirus Earth Science. Today is May 4th and we're working on day 12A, which is station model practice. All right, um, just so that you're aware, your grades for this week, you're gonna have a station model lab, which you should be working on tomorrow. It's gonna be in Schoology. Um, that is due on Friday. And then you're also gonna have a Google form quiz that will be due on Friday, all right? All, all things will be graded on Saturday like usual. So please make sure that you get them done. So um, this worksheet is pretty self-explanatory. On the front page, you're basically deciphering the station model, all right? Taking the data from the station model and then just writing down what it means. And on the second page, you're making the station model. So I'll do the first example of each okay so for this one the temperature is always in the top left and that's in degrees fahrenheit so that's going to be 75 degrees fahrenheit the dew point is always in the bottom left in fahrenheit so that's going to be 23 degrees fahrenheit wind direction is going up to the north so that, remember, that flagpole always says where it's coming from. So wind direction is from the north. Wind speed. All right, so anytime you see that feather and it's going off, you, you can't really tell if it's a full-length feather or a, or a half-length feather, but if you see that it's not starting all the way at the end like this, that means that it's going to be a 5. Okay, so this is five knots. Okay, all right, actually they're using uh, miles per hour. Five miles per hour. Cloud cover, the circle is not colored in at all, so it's gonna be clear. So that's 0%. The pressure, all right, so right here, this is where we have to do our conversions, right? So that's in coded form. So we need to add either a nine or 10 in front. And if you remember the rule, it also, it also says it up here, right? Um, the rule is, is that if it is less than 500, you put a 10 in front. Okay, so that's less than 500. So we put a 10 in front. You add your decimal between the last two and then you add your unit, okay? Current weather usually goes here and there's nothing. So you write nothing, all right? So that's pretty much it. So you're gonna do that for the rest of the ones on this page. And then over here, this is where you are doing the opposite. You're taking the data and you are making a station model, all right? So the temperature is 33, that always goes in top left. Dew point is 16, bottom left, wind direction is coming from the northwest. So that means it's coming from here at 15. So you're going to have a long one and a half one. Cloud cover is 50%. Pressure, all right, so remember how to do these. You get rid of the 9 or 10, you get rid of the decimal, you get rid of the unit. And that's going to be the code that you write down. Current weather is none. All right, so that's pretty much it. Finish up the worksheet. And uh, that is your Monday assignment. If you want to get a head start, go into Schoology and you can start your station model lab. That's your assignment for tomorrow. Pretty simple. Um, I'll put up a video for that as well.